Baku, Azerbaijan, Jan. 16 by Azad Hassan Lee, Trend, The Society for Worldwide Interbank Financial Telecommunication, SWIFT, and seven central securities depositories, CSDs, have signed a Memorandum of Understanding, MOU, to work together to demonstrate how distributed ledger technology could be implemented in post-trade scenarios, such as corporate actions processing, including voting and proxy voting, SWIFT said in a message Jan. 16. The group will investigate the types of new products that can be built using it, and how existing standards such as ISO 20000 and 22 can support it. Abu Dhabi Securities Exchange, Kaja de Valors, Depositu Central de Valors, Nasdaq Market Technology AB, National Settlement Depository, Six Security Services and Straight Limited are among the CSDs participating in the DLT, Distributed Ledger Technology, project with SWIFT. Additional CSDs are expected to join in the coming weeks. Today, securities processing, particularly in areas requiring multi-party contact, involve extremely cumbersome manual processes that can carry significant inherent cost and risk. As a part of the MOU, SWIFT and the CSDs have defined the product requirements for an e-voting solution based on DLT that includes common standards, ISO 2022, and principles. To ensure interoperability and smooth migration, it is crucial that new technologies support existing common standards such as ISO 20022, said Stephen Lindsay, head of standards at SWIFT. The promise of the technology on paper is great, but it is currently missing a key component around standardization. There is clear value in reusing established business definitions and facilitating interoperability amongst DLT implementations, which this project will demonstrate. Other aspects of the MOU include fostering collaboration amongst the CSD community and DLT research and development, helping define the role of financial market infrastructure providers in markets based on distributed ledgers and identifying, defining and developing additional use cases for DLT in a CSD environment and the post-trade landscape, such as services for different kinds of DLT-based digital assets. In addition, the group will focus on creating and adapting common standards and principles for the use of DLT amongst CSDs and the financial industry, and promoting the adoption of those standards and principles to other parties, including regulators. Confirming the importance of the CSD Working Group on DLT, the International Security Services Association, ISA, recently endorsed the group and included it as part of a new work stream within the association's existing Working Group on DLT, giving this initiative greater industry visibility. As a part of ISA, the CSD Working Group on DLT will initially focus on digital assets with a goal to establish a business framework for how these assets could be used in the post-trade space. The framework will identify key definitions, classifications, services and post-trade service provider roles. Findings from the use case on digital assets are expected to be published in Q2. We are very excited to welcome the CSD Working Group on DLT into ISA, said Thomas Zeeb, CEO, Six Security Services and Chairman, ISA. There is a lot of potential for DLT in securities processing and the work being led by the CSD Working Group on DLT is tackling a key challenge related to emerging technologies, which is a clear lack of standards. As the industry evolves, DLT-specific standards such as ISO 20022 will provide a great foundation in terms of both existing business content and approach. Follow Trend on Telegram. Only most interesting and important news.